Novice gardeners always ask me the question, why should I bother putting a water feature in? Oh, it's going to be so much of a headache and so many problems to worry about. But folks, the positives far outweigh any negatives that you could ever think about. Here are some of them. They add that extra sound, that sound of running water. You just can't beat it. Immediately it relaxes you and takes you to a different place. It adds a new dimension into your garden. If you've got a small garden, putting it at the end of a path makes it seem deeper and give, gives you more depth. And of course, it's the adventure and the intrigue by putting in a water feature. You can just add that extra pizzazz. And of course, one of the most important factors of water features is that they attract wildlife. Often standing in my kitchen, looking out onto my water features, the birds are there early in the morning, sitting on the edge of the terracotta pot, having a little bath, getting a few sips of water, and that has to be the best part of having them in your garden. There are many different styles of water feature that you can choose from today. And you know what, when I think about 20 years ago, when I was a mere seedling in the gardening industry, wow, we were so limited. But today, you can literally walk into a garden center, choose your water feature, bang it into your car, and that afternoon, you'll be sitting having a good drink next to your bubbling water feature. And it's as simple as that. Of course, those are the contained ones where you literally buy the sump, the pot, or whatever it is where the water is going to be bubbling through, or even if it's just a pump where the water can then just sprout out of. There are far more intricate water features, ones that require a hell of a lot more work. That's where you've got to dig the hole, you either then line it with the waterproofing material, and then you put your pump in, making sure that everything's sealed. And further from that, you could add a beautiful terracotta pot in, or even something glazed, which would then act as the medium from where the water goes through. 